Hey, how's everybody doing tonight? Um, gonna have a quick mail day. Um, got a contest drawing win and a nice uh, coin in the mail and also a couple Kirby Puckets. So I think tonight I'll start with uh, a contest drawing win. Another shout out to Rob at Cash Cards. Um, great channel. I was the number three winner in the drawing. So actually felt like I did a lot better with the card I received. Um, I did the contest. The other two winners picked cards and then I got what was left over, which to me is a very nice card. Thanks, Rob, for running the contest. I really love this card. Um, fun contest. Congrats on uh, 300 subs. And one extra bonus Rob threw in there was this nice Royce Lewis rated rookie. I don't know what you call it, but it looks like a lot of little spirography things refractor it's a Royce Lewis card I didn't have um, and that goes in my Royce Lewis collection thanks again Rob fun contest um, check his channel out it's well worth it um, next uh, item I got in I got this laser uh, 1996 tops laser it's actually nice laser cut there on the left side I've never had a card like this before but it's part of this playing days run that I'm putting together that was kind of a cool card and another upper deck die cut from 96 that I picked up came in the mail That's the uh, hot commodities. There's your flame right there. Hot, hot, hot. So I'm at 447 for my pocket count. And there's right around a thousand playing days cards that are that fit in the top loader. And that's the only restriction I have. They fit in the top loader and the top loaders fit in my box. And I expect to have around a thousand cards when I'm done. And the last item I have to show you, 1971 Topps coins. I remember opening packs and pulling these coins out. And I do have a coin collection of the 65 Old London. I'm working on that set. So this is probably taking my mind off it. Um, the PSA graded sevens or higher have kind of disappeared. From eBay I don't see them at shows so I'm just kind of get sidetracked off and on and picked up a 1971 PSA 7 Tony Oliva I remember the ones I had back in the day they all get nice and rubbed together and scratched and dinged and all the good stuff so we'll see where there's where this leads in the future I have a, another mail day coming in next week. Um, nice hockey set. Actually, two hockey sets. And a SGC reveal coming up next week. So um, I'm going to be heading to the flea market in McKinney, Texas this Saturday. It's supposed to be like 400 vendors there. So you never know what you're going to find at a flea market. It's like a box of chocolates, I guess. You never know what you're going to find. So thanks, everybody, for watching, and have a great weekend.